Well, with Dr. Covington's resignation, the move allows the state to step in and run the Kansas City School District. Missouri State Representative Myron Neff, who is on the state's education committee, said people were happy with Covington's progress. He says with so many questions surrounding Covington's sudden exit, he feels it'll have some in Jefferson City saying enough is enough and that they need to get strong leadership in place and fix the district. I think Kansas City's finally come to might maybe to a breaking point on this deal because I think for the majority of people liked Covington. I, I know I, I mean I was very you know I, I thought highly of him. The state has already taken control of the St. Louis school system. Dr. Covington's resignation raises new concerns for Kansas City schools. The Missouri Department of Elementary and Secondary Education says it's worried about the stability of the district's leadership. The Commissioner of Education, Dr. Chris Nicastro, says the department will recommend whatever action is necessary to represent the best interests of the education of the district's children. And, unfortunately, with Dr. Covington's departure, the implementation of the current plan for improvement is now at risk. We caught up with Kansas City leaders today to see how they're responding to Dr. Covington's abrupt resignation. I don't want to get into the blame game and trying to find some reason to say that somebody did something to cause this because that just contributes to the hysteria and I don't think that's what we need. But we need a not a short-term commitment, but a long-term commitment to making this work. We have real lives at stake that not only affect the education of children, but it affects the quality of living in this city. You can read more reaction from local leaders on Dr. Covington's resignation at NBCActionNews.com under Spotlight. And we have more coverage of Dr. Covington's resignation. Coming up at 613, we talk to parents about the hot topic throughout the Kansas City schools, plus the past rumors that Dr. Covington fought off about leaving the district. Also, you can read all about our past coverage of Dr. Covington's time as superintendent. That's on NBCActionNews.com under Education. Right.